Okay, we're still on the wingtip boat. <clears throat> I'm about to start blocking it all in beyond the initial blocking in that I started. And we'll start right here with this. Get out of that light. Come on, focus. All right. Anyways, one more block under there. I got this little nub right here. There we go. It's focused now. First, I got to scratch that up. Of course. I'm gonna clean up that there little bit of glue right there and scuff it all up. Sorry about that. I just had to do it. I think that's the funniest little song I've ever heard. But anyways, uh, wingtip bow is a lot of fun and uh, a lot of detail in it. And it's really fun when you, you start wrapping your plane, start covering. A um, little bit of a hassle getting that handle that I put in there. I, you'll see it here in a little bit. I'm putting the handle in. But uh, um, very rewarding. Now, once again, I've done the wingtip bow so that it is parallel with the cord. So you can see the cord, the most, the furthest forward point on the leading edge, right back to the trailing edge. That's how I've made mine. And this is where the print would have had 
the back. The only way for that position to meet up with the trailing edge, this here wingtip bow would have to be like up here. And then dropping down to there. Well, I don't, I don't know. I don't. But right here's what it, where it shows the, on the print for the main spar to be connected, and right there for the rear spar to be connected. Okay, I'm nearly complete with the wingtip bow attachment. Of course, this here will get all trimmed and sanded down and blended and that. Now, notice I've kept this here clamped in place because you don't want this to change any, and that's. That's one thing I uh, I didn't do one time is I, I had the uh, aileron cut out and therefore I didn't have anything to gauge this with and I ended up, this here had moved in some and I ended up having to trim a lot of this, make that fairly thin in there. But uh, it's almost done. As you can see I've got everything glued, glued up on both sides of the uh, rear spar and then I've got the stiffeners on the main spar and then I've got the handles the stiffeners that help out with it and I've got the handle fitted in here and this here's what you're gonna grip the wing with plenty big enough and then oh I've got one more I'm gonna do well I've already got the material cut it's actually sitting right down there the material but I'm going to take it from right there down to here and top and bottom and then it'll be finished